Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Roaming with the Richards. I'm Angelica. This is Jonathan, in case you don't recognize him, because um, we had to shave his beard. Yep, <laughs> um, it's gone. It's, it's so, sad. Um, it's the first time you shaved for like, what, two years or something it's like that? It's more than two least, years. Well, over two, because yeah. I want to say three. Two to three. Yeah. Yeah, somewhere in that range. So anyway, as you can see, we're here at Tweetsie Railroad. Um, and we are coming for the ghost train. Um, this is opening night, uh, September 20th? Yep. 20th. Um, so we're gonna check out and see what theme they've gone with this year. Um, Not only see the theme that they got going on for the show this year, but also get a good look at the train because this year is the first time since I wanna say the 90s that engine 190, the Yukon Queen, gets to run during the day and during the night. So it'd be starting tomorrow on the 21st. She's going to be running during the Wild West show during the day and then run for the ghost train at night. Yep. So we get to see how she looks as well um, throughout the night. How's everybody doing tonight? Oh, pathetic. I oh, know you can do better than that. I said, how is everybody doing? That's a lot better. Who is ready for a scary night tonight? There we go, that's what I like to hear. Go ahead, I know you want to dance. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Pixie Railroad. Alright guys, so here at Ghost Train at Tweetsie Railroad, the main attraction is the train ride. 
but you also have one haunted house and a freaky four so practically two haunted trails that you can go on um and right behind us is the haunted house so we're gonna go inside and check that out as well So we just got out of the haunted house. <laughs> that was actually pretty good. They, um, that was like the best haunted house they've done, not gonna lie. Yeah, they, I mean, like, they've they got out, me. They outdid themselves this year. <laughs> they they got, uh, got us quite a bit this year, so. Uh, I love the scene setups. And the mirror, okay, the mirror one was like amazing. Yeah, it's like, well, like, I Cause I was I looking at pet. the chair and I was looking at the mirror, I was like, it's not a mirror, is it? And then that's when the girl popped yeah, out and she it's scared like, me. <laughs> yeah, that, that was like the weird part though. It's like, all right, I walked past and like, okay, this don't look like a mirror. But it don't look like there's nobody ready to kind of yeah. pop out. So I'm like, all right, I'll just keep moving. <laughs> and then I turn right I when like Angel already screamed. So it's like, well, I didn't really catch the scare part itself, but I did catch her at least coming out. So. Yeah, well, it was funny because she caught it right when like I just had walked past it. And I was kind of looking at it like, okay, yeah. there's nobody there. And then next thing I know, like just as I barely walked into the frame, she walked in and I was like, oh gosh. Oh, yeah. then, <laughs> well, the best part was I don't even think. You got my reaction, but you did not get the scare actor at all. But one scare actor came up right behind me and scared the crap out of me. Yeah. Um, like right when like I wasn't expecting it. Uh, so that this year, yeah, definitely check out the haunted house this year. <laughs> it's really, I mean, this is amazing. Yeah. So like we said, not only you got the uh, haunted house, but over by the boneyard. We can make our way towards the freaky One, forest. Two, three, you can already hear the chainsaws in the background. All right, guys, so you got the freaky forest. Well, I'm 
already getting it. Welcome. Welcome to the Freaky Farms, folks. Thank you. Have you ever been here before? Yes. You yeah. have? Yeah. All right. You will have a little path to walk through in here. And it's, I would say, I would call it a straight path, but there's a lot of curves in it. But you don't have to go under anything or over anything. There's actors in there, they won't touch you, you don't touch them. No flash photography. There is some emergency exits. If you need one, you shouldn't need one. Have fun. So also in the Bone Yard area, not only do you have the Forky Forest, but you also have two other attractions. One of them is the Black Halls, and the other one is the, uh, is it Warp Tunnel? Warp Tunnel. Warp Tunnel. walking.
in behind us here is Tweetsie Palace. So this is where you can catch the family friendly puppet show. It's like a glow in the dark kind of puppets. They do different songs and kind of spooky Halloween themed, but in a kid friendly way. So um, they, you can also get refreshments, yep. snacks, pretzels, ice cream, and all that good stuff up here too. Let's go check it out. Top to the Miner's Mountain, but you can't go into the creepy, freaky carnival. Yeah, they got the fog machines turned way up today. Oh yeah, it's at night. Like the good Look, list, can we you can't see us? <laughs> barely, <laughs> barely on the screen. But we're gonna flip the camera around and show you inside the creepy carnival. Another fun family activity that you can do is going to be trick-or-treating. Walking out of the the creepy carnival area, we go take a adventure to see what creepy kind of snacks they have over at the fun shop. Yeah. 
dirty, please board now. First train shall be departing for six minutes. The train ride time is 9.30. Please hold. All right, we're on the ghost train. Uh, boarded for our 9.30 train. And ready to go. Yep, it looks like it's uh, a whole entire different show from last year. Blue Ridge Phantom Corporation. So we're going to... Go on the ride and see what it what waits. Alright guys, um, that's going to conclude our video here today, at, or well, tonight, here at Tweetsie Railroad for their ghost train. Um, again, once again, this was opening weekend, opening night, which is uh, September 20th. September 21st, engine 190 runs double duty. Um, outside of that, I mean, the train ride this year was pretty neat. Um, I do think the Wolf last year was a little bit better, um, my personal opinion. I would almost kind of had to ride the train again to get a little bit better of an idea of what's going on. Yeah, I think it. I think too because it was opening night, so it was a little bit. And it's Friday, so it's a little bit slower. Yeah. Um, I bet with more people on it, I think that it would have hit a little bit differently, maybe. But um, yeah, I'm sure as October rolls around, there's definitely going to be more crowds and everything. It, oh yeah. It tends to get busier during actual spooky season versus early. We're a little early. But it's done yet. The haunted house and the yes. freaky forest was still amazing. They did, um, yeah. The creepy carnival, I believe it's called. But anyway, that area is really neat as far as how well lit up it is. Every like it is every year. Mm -hmm. Ooh, um, sorry. Outside of that, oh, sorry. we will uh, catch y'all next time. Thanks for watching. Later.